Say hi. Hey. <laughs> Yeah, like my opa body. Some of y'all this. Don't worry, I got it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, welcome to Seriously Skyline TV. Today we're discussing, well it's a new series, if you are not very familiar with it right as yet. It's called 21 Questions with Sky. So, 10 episodes. And today we have my longtime friend, my high school friend, <laughs> what? My high school friend, Shane Clark. I didn't say we meet in high school, but you want to tell them anything about how we meet? Um, <laughs> I think we met uh, in 10 grade, was IT class. Okay. Yeah, this is how we met. And ever since then, thick as thieves. Yeah. <laughs> So if you guys don't know what this is about, it's obviously, as the name says, suggests, obviously as the name suggests, 21 questions with Sky. So right now, I have a pool of cards brought to us by Best Self Icebreaker that have questions designed to have deep conversations and deep relationships. It's to help us understand better. Some of these people, like Shane, <laughs> Some of these people like Shane, I know already, but maybe I don't know him that well. So this is what this is geared towards doing. Help me understand him a bit more. As well as <laughs> um, just to open up. So not everyone will be my friend already. Some of them are actual strangers. Some of them are associates. So I hope you guys enjoy that series. This series. But before I get into the video, like, come on, like, share, and subscribe. Cue the intro. So we're ready to pull up the questions. Um, we have questions of varying card color. The yellow, as you can see right here, is random questions. The gray, as you can see right here, it's life questions. The red is said to be deep. Blue is said to be experiences. And um, green is if you could. Like a would you rather thing? Well, it's an if you could thing. Because then we have purple. I think this is purple. What's purple? Okay, this is actually would you rather, which is why I said that. No. Let's begin. I'll be just taking one randomly from each pack and asking him. You better answer honestly. No problem. I try my best. All right. So to lighten up the mood, I'm going to start with a uh, if you could just a green pack. You ready? I'm ready. Make sure you're ready. Look. If you could know when and how you are going to die, would you want to know? No, no. You don't want to know when you're going to nope. die? Why? I don't want to know when I'm going to die. Why? Because when I know when I'm going to die, chances are I'm going to do a whole lot of 30 days before I die. Yeah. You mean not try to worship God and so that you go to heaven when you die? I'm going to do a whole lot of days. <laughs> he said it, not yeah, me. Sure. <laughs> he said it, not me. Alright. So the next pack I'll be pulling from. Would you rather be too hot or too cold? Um, cool probably. So you you rather be too cold? Yeah. Why? I don't really like to be seen that much. Yeah. No, as in temperature hot. Like mm. like you are summer or winter. Too hot or too cold. <laughs> oh, <it's> so, <laughs> so which one is it now? 
Which one is it? Um, I got the the heat more than the cold. Really? Yeah, come on, we can't send the cold. Okay. If I rub it on the sweater, then the sheet, and all these things, and all that. All right. Next question. Oh wait, I didn't shuffle. What's the first concert you ever went to? Concert. Where yeah. is the concert? Hmm. The church boy is still in the so first concert will be now. Uh, See, church boy, which is why I don't understand why I'm saying I'm going to do one more to date. If you know what I'm going to do. I'm going to do this. No, I'm going to do this. Um, was a gossip concert by Ken Cut. Okay, cool. Yeah, that's the first yeah, that's, that that's the Shane I met, the Christian Shane. <laughs> still, still. Still a Christian. All right. Next question. What is one accomplish which com which accomplish <laughs> which accomplishment are you most proud of? Ooh. Um I don't know how to answer that one. Seriously. Do you really think man? Accomplishment. I think I might have a lot, but I think um my I had a short term plan, yeah, say that? Yeah. Mm -hmm. On a five year plan actually. Mm -hmm. And I think so far in that five year plan, I accomplished four major things I wanted to the five. So which one are you so most proud of? Tell us. Most proud of is um I guess my job. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I guess my job is the uh, one I'm most proud of. Mm -hmm. I should I tell my occupation? Should we? I don't know. I need the occupation <laughs> for the next But time. you're proud of the occupation. But I'm proud of my occupation, so I really enjoy it. Mm -hmm. That's what life is all about, right? Mm -hmm. Alright, so what was the last foreign country you visited? No? You've never visited a foreign country? Nope. But he's a bot, so. But I'm a <laughs> <laughs> Alright, um. What were your three biggest turning points in your life? That's deep. Yo, that is too deep. <laughs> three biggest turning points in my life. Mm. I really don't know how to answer that question. I'm being honest. You're gonna answer it. He's gonna answer it. It's I'm just gonna a longer time. Yeah. Maybe you don't have to give me three, right? So yeah. I found two. I reduce it to two. Turning point. You don't want to share? Not that question. Uh, move on. She vetoed that question. You don't want to talk about it. Look at her about to tear up. Uh, emotional, so I won't go in there. So. You're going to tell me after we stop recording? Yes, after we stop recording, I'll tell you everything. This one? Because you've been told this one, you're getting another deep one. When was the last time you cried and why? Last time I cried? Mm -hmm. And why? Mm. Um, the last time I cried, I was watching a movie actually. Which movie? <laughs> Which movie? Oh Which movie God. makes Shane Clark cry? Um, it was a love movie. Aww. A yeah. romance movie. Yeah, I know some I really have fun up there, but mm -hmm. this one in particular had me on the Netflix. Um, I soon know many, I soon tell them yeah. You are looking at your phone? Tell them your mind. Tell them your yeah. What was it about? Maybe I watched it. Oh, teens. Teen love as usual. And then the, 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 the guy died. Really? Yeah, he went into the lake and. Okay, my God. Rough. I don't know. Really. You cried. Yes. Oh. I'm not even really crying. <laughs> I just said At least you wouldn't admit it if you did. <laughs> right? Alright, next question. If you could never work again, 
How would you spend your time? I had that one. If I could never work again. So what would you do if you didn't have to work again? Really and truly, I think I just travel mm -hmm. and just experience yeah. every culture. I'm with you on that one. Every culture. Yeah. Me that. Yeah. All right. What is one family tradition you would like to carry on in the future? That's something we do every night, every Saturday night. That's something we do. As a, as a kid, you played that with your parents? Of course. Wow, you invited that with a friend, a closest friend. Every Saturday night, I played them, and I must hunt again. <laughs> okay. Alright, what is one thing you wish you could do differently in the future? Oh, that's a good question. Would you rather be slightly late or super early? Well, it depends on the situation. Right now, I would say um, early. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's what you're gonna be. I think I'd rather be earlier too. What's the first music you bought? I mean, we're Jamaicans, we don't buy music. Yeah, come on. <laughs> we don't really <laughs> buy music. <laughs> but maybe like, like, what's the first music you download? Like, type of music you download? Maybe when like MP4 came in and that kind of stuff. Oh yeah, man. Ask me this. For nineties babies. Yeah, so you know what I'm saying. Live wire. Live wire. Yes, man. Mm -hmm. Um. I think it was a. Should I say? Yeah. Um, He's asking you, like, want you uh, to be honest. It's a safe man, space. Being a man's son. Which one, like, King of Dogs, or Pumbe, 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 um, that road one there. I want to do what the wicked is saying. Yeah, I remember that song. Yeah, I remember it. All right. Which piece are you when you play Monopoly? Monopoly. Yeah. You play Monopoly? Later, I started to play that game. Um, I'm mostly at the car mm -hmm. or the hat. Car hat. Interesting. Yeah. You know why? Why you pick those two? I'm a car man. That's a lot for sure. The hat thing. Gentleman. Okay. Yeah. I'm usually like the puppy. I, I like the puppy or the boat. I think it's the boat. A puppy. Yeah. I think puppies are cute. And then I used to play online. I used yeah. to play online. So there was a little an animation thing every time my, my puppy moved. I just thought oh. that was cute. So you hear. Burr, 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 <laughs> I'm weird. I know I'm weird, but that's why I thought that was cute. What's something you disagree with with about the way you were raised? I like that question, and I hope you answer it and not veto it. Yeah, deep question. All right. Um, I think uh, I should say parents mm -hmm. they should have allowed me to take part in more in school activities. Really? Extra credit activity. Yeah. Um, I didn't know that I didn't know that. Didn't really that. Like it. Um I guess because of the community that the school was located mm -hmm. and the hours that we get home. Oh so they yeah, were concerned your you a late. Yeah. Okay. So that's the most problem I had with them. By the way he said that that's because we went to um Excelsior, Excelsior High, High which is on Mountain View Avenue yeah. in Kingston, Jamaica. Yeah, it's pretty unsafe sometimes, but I guess his parents have a good reason to be content. That's a good reason. Come on, I'm glad to play volleyball. I enjoyed it. <laughs> I enjoyed it. You know, I enjoyed volleyball. I know. But it's a tip He was like, This person. Don't say it. Don't say it. Oh, mm. no, say. no. Okay, I won't say it. He said, he told me not to say it. So. Oh gosh. That guy's trouble now. What kind of trouble gonna <laughs> cause? He was my first boyfriend. He's my high school boyfriend. That's how we met. And maybe I should actually tell you a story, a story time about that. I think it's quite interesting. It's something I tell people all the time. Do you know that? No, I didn't know that. I tell people sometimes. Like when high school. But it's a story I might share with you guys in the future. Alright, so 
What state or country do you never want to go back to? Or in this case, what parish? Yes. Because we're in Jamaica, we don't have states, we have parish. I just realized that didn't make any sense. <laughs> <laughs> but okay, what parish would you not go back to? Um, West London. Why? How? Too far. Yeah, but that's why. I, I think I think West London is all amazing. I think West London is amazing. The only thing is, as he said, it's very far. I'm sorry, it's very far, but that's where I only go to West London if I'm staying at an Airbnb, a motel, a hotel, or something. I wouldn't go for a day. But why are you? That's it. I went to I went to Westmoreland in in December mm -hmm. to bring in the New Year, and let me tell you, I did not know that a Yenyen ruled that parish. I've never heard of that until I went there, and for some of my foreigners, Yenyens are these little bikes, right? Bikes. Yeah, bikes. some cheap bikes that are like bicycles in Jamaica. Apparently, they're like bike taxes, yang yang taxes in the girl. I was really, I was very shocked by that. You didn't know that? No? Yes! No. People go, that's that's like 30 to 50 dollars on a yang yang taxi. That's actually a thing. Mm -hmm. Yes, I remember turning into a community to go to um, where the cliffs are, I don't remember what it is. And I, I kid you not, five bikes pass me every five minutes. And I'm like, what the hell is going on? And then the person I was just like, yeah, what's more like, is a Bye. Yeah, by Paris. That's a little that's a little thing in case you didn't know. Alright, next question. What would your rap name be? Rap name? Yeah. I know what I would make your rap name. Mmm. <laughs> oh that's a that's a very interesting one. Rap. Um, some guys I used to be from TV and mm -hmm. Oh crud. Um, well, that's what we need right now. Really? Um, <laughs> let's see if I go to the water, 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 If I, if, if I should create a rap name, it would be something related to your eyes or your hair. <laughs> Maybe that's what I keep rap name. I'm a soft first. Why are you not far from me? Well, <laughs> all right. Would you rather give up your smartphone or your computer? My computer. Really? That's an easy question. Yeah. Computer. I know, right? Because yeah. your smartphone is like a computer. A computer. <laughs> yeah. What activity do you enjoy so much that it makes you lose track of time? I mean, I know that for me. I know that specific word for me. Um, PUBG for me. <laughs> that's my answer. Oh, yeah, I think no, I'm that's legit. Like, oh, like recently, around March, I think it's March, that's how I said, I was introduced to PUBG, right? Yes. And I used to exercise, and ever since I've been playing PUBG, sometimes I start around 8 and I'm like, okay, I have not time to play PUBG. Yeah. By the time I finish, oh, gosh. it's like yeah. after one, and I'm like, what? Yeah, man, that's PUBG for you, man. I'm like, what? When did Why the time go? Why can't you go this is man? Yeah, this is the All right. So if you could pick up a skill instantly, what would it be? Mm. Skill. I think it would be... Welding. Welding? Yeah. Oh, that's interesting. Yeah, welding. Why welding? Hmm. I have a money. Can you make something money? Like welding makes out of money? Of course. Okay. I think because you could create a lot of stuff in different designs and like girls. Mm -hmm. I think I like it mostly about it. I like how they form. Um, I like that you can literally just think of anything. Put two a better piece of metal together and boom! Alright, yeah. so you like to create? I mean that one. Okay. Not that much. What is a mistake people often make about you? Um, that 
I am someone who can like uh, approach them. Really? Yeah, that's them to work. I would have thought, I thought, guess what? You're to what? Kakati. Oh, I don't see you as cocky. But you know what I thought he would have said? I thought he would have said, mm -hmm. um, what's that word we give to poor men? <laughs> No. 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 Yes, <laughs> For the record, I'm not a woman, I'm a one burner. Yeah, one burner. Yeah, he's a good guy. Um, <laughs> that's what I thought you would say. Who are three people you want on your team if there was a zombie apocalypse? Three person. Virgin and two one grand Sanjay. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, I'm on Sanjay Hall. That's my best bud. Yeah. Then you have Chevron. Mm -hmm. Like Chevron from Young Chevron? Young Day Chevron. Young Day Chevron, man. Yes. Mm -hmm. And I guess I would have, um, you know, Alex. Alex Allen. Okay. Thoughts. Yeah. I'm offended that he did not say my name. This is Zambia for the So what does that mean? Survival of the fittest. So I'm not good at surviving? That's not nice. You need at least somebody slower than you. Like if zombies are coming, yeah. do you get what I'm saying? You want me to say what? You want to say I'm not going to lie to you. If I had to pick a team, I'm choosing at least one person slower than I am. Savage. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we have two more questions. Okay. I like this one. What's your love language? I like that one. My love language? Mm -hmm. Afterwards, I tell you. That's what I'm telling you. Whispering. 